Hello, welcome to Alphabet Ready Phonological Awareness Activities. My name is Miss Lena. Today we'll talk about rhyming words and the letter L. But first, let's start with the ABC clap. A, B, C, we're going up, we're going down, we're going crisscross, lollipop, pull the chain, Turn around, touch the ground, full stop. Now I have two words here, two rhyming words. Rain and train. Do you know why they are rhyming words? It's because the ending is the same in both of these. A. Rain and train. Now let's find a rhyming word for the word cat. Now here are all our choices. Does cat rhyme with star, swing, mouse, or bat? Cat. Bat. Cat and bat rhyme. Now let's find a rhyming word for the word house. Star. Swing. Mouse. House. Mouse. House, mouse, they rhyme. Now let's find a rhyming word for the word car. Star, swing, car, star. Those match in the ending sounds. Car, star, rhyme. All right. Here's letter L. There's the uppercase L, and here's the lowercase L. Now tell me, is this a letter L? No. What's the name of this letter? J. How about this one? Is this a letter L? Nope. What's the name of this letter? T. Is this a letter L? Yes, that's the uppercase L, isn't it? How about this one? No. What's the name of this letter? F. Is this a letter L? Yes, that's the lowercase L. Now, letter L makes a sound like this. L. You make it with your tongue up high in your mouth, touching the top. And the sound has to come from the sides of the tongue. Ugh. You can even see it. You can see the bottom of my tongue. Ugh. Or the underside of it, can't you? Now, if you're learning Letterland, it is Lucy Lamplight who makes the letter L sound. This is what she does. She's got a lamp shade above her head. Ugh. Does the word fox start with the L? Fox. No. Fox starts with the letter F sound. What if it started with the letter L sound instead? It would be a L ox locks. Does the word Lamp start with the letter L sound. L lamp. Does the word turtle start with the L sound? Turtle. Turtle starts with the T sound. What would you call it if it started with the letter L 
vanilla sound instead. A uh, erdle, lurdle. Hmm. No, that's a turtle. Does the word jet start with the uh? Jet. No. Jet starts with the j sound, doesn't it? Now, what would you call it if it started with the letter L sound instead? A l et let. Does the word lion start with the l? Lion, it does. All right, let's make a puzzle. All the words in our puzzle will start with the letter L sound. Oh. Now, who is the king of the jungle? A lion, a lion. Lemon, juice. Don't say juice. Lemon. Now what's that lovely drink made out of lemons? Lemonade. Do you like lemonade? This next word has two syllables or two claps in it. Lobster. Have you heard of a lobster? Lobster. Lolly. Pop. You get lollipop. This last word rhymes with blizzard, but it starts with ooh. Lizard is a lizard. And there it is. We made the letter L. Is that the uppercase L or the lowercase L? It's the uppercase, isn't it? Now lion starts with L. Lemon starts with L. Lobster, lollipop, and lizard, they all start with L. Now I'm thinking about lollipops. Do you like lollipops? What's your favorite flavor? Now here's a fun rhyme. Put up three fingers. One luscious, two luscious, three luscious lollipops. Strawberry, lemon, lime flavored lollipops. Let's all lick them down to their little sticks. We love lollipops. Lick and love. They also start with the letter L sound, don't they? Now look at all these different colors of lollipops. That gives me an idea. Wouldn't it be fun to make a lollipop alphabet? You could make up a flavor for each letter of the alphabet. Like for letter A, you could call it Amazing Apricot. And for letter B, you could call it Blueberry Bomb. You could go like this through the whole alphabet and making silly or, or funny or yummy flavors. And you could even do this in your classroom. You could take everybody's first name, like A for Annabelle, and it could be Annabelle, Annabelle's Amazing Apricot, and B for Ben's Blueberry Bomb. I think it'll be an interesting alphabet, don't you? A rather delicious alphabet. Or you could just make up a flavor of your very own based on your first name. Like my name is Lena, so my lollipop flavor could be Lena's Lovely Lemonade. Now, 
In this puzzle, I see three different animals that all start with the letter L sound. Can you tell them, tell me those letter, uh, names of those animals? A lion and a lobster and a lizard. Now, can you think of any other animals that start with the letter L sound? How about a ladybug? Now do this with me. Ladybug, ladybug, fly out of the farm and land right on my little arm. Ladybug, ladybug, fly out of the tree and land right on my little knee. Ladybug. Ladybug, fly out of your bed and land right on my little head. Ladybug, ladybug, fly out of the rose and land right on my little nose. Now, here's another animal that starts with the letter L sound. He's been climbing all over my chair. Come on over here. Friend, this is a lemur. This is a ringtailed lemur. Now we have a book about lemurs. It's called L is for Lemur. And it's ABC of Endangered Primates, written by Sharon Katz Cooper. Can you find the letter L's in the title? Right there and right there. Now there are over hundred different kinds of lemurs and they all live mostly on an island called Madagascar. Now most of the lemurs are not uh, diurnal, meaning that they sleep at night and stay active during the day just like we do, but some are nocturnal. And here's a little rhyme about nocturnal lemurs. Lemur stays in bed all day and waits until the night to play. That's why his soft feet make no sound and why his eyes are big and round. And I'll show you a picture of a nocturnal lemur in this book. Look at that one. It's called a mouse lemur. Do you see the big round eyes? Looks kind of sweet, doesn't it? All right, that's all I had for today. I hope to see you at the library, but until then, let's get flying, little lion. Bye-bye. Be sure to click on the words Show More located underneath this video on YouTube to access links to more fun activities around the shape and sound of the focus letter in this video. If you're on a mobile device and you'd like access to those links, just click on the icon indicated here in the green circle.